and welcome to a quick tutorial about functioning of the Atlas and Data section on Carbon Escapes web application. On the Carbon Escapes web page at the Carbon Escapes org, you click on Atlas. This brings you to Launch Atlas tab. Clicking on this will launch Atlas application. This application is focused on US extent. Top part of the map shows different types of functionalities and the right side of the map displays results. This application summarizes carbon pools and you can answer questions like how many million metric tons of soil carbon or CO2 equivalents are in the upper meter of soil in your home county? Or how many acres of forest would it take in one year to sequester the mass of carbon in the upper meter of soil. Now let's explore detailed functionalities in this application. Geographic area drop-down allows user to choose between county, watershed, or ecological region. We will choose county here. Carbon pool allows user to choose between topsoil, which is 0 to 30 centimeter depth, or soil, which is 0 to 100 centimeter depth. We will add additional choices in this drop-down as the data layers become available. We will choose soil from this drop-down. We have option to change the carbon calculation by stock or mass. Carbon unit drop-down allows user to choose either international or English units. Search can be performed by two ways. Either a user clicks on a map or enters a zip code. Opacity of the layers can be controlled from here at the bottom. Now we will click on a county. Clicking on a county selects that area, map zooms to that location and the results for that specific county is displayed on the right. Results in the first bar shows the amount of the carbon present in that particular area. Second bar shows the carbon percentile. Now let's change option from stock to mass. In this case, results show the amount of carbon and its relation to the passenger vehicle's emission per year. Home energy use in one year or the number of acres of forest needed to capture amount of carbon in one year. If you want to learn more about the results and application, you can click this link here at the bottom and it takes you to the learn section where you can learn in detail about stock or mass. Now let's explore the data section. Data tab catalogs and links users to USDA carbon data resources. Left column shows the type of data and the right column shows the location of the data. For example, if we click here at metadata, it will search the data on data.gov. On the other hand, if we click view or download, it will show data on Carbon Escape Explorer application. Explorer is the theme of our next video. This is it for the Atlas and the data section. Thanks for viewing.